Welcome back to Make Way for Cat. Last episode we found Mandy and we got this cool sword. All right, let's see what's on the docket today. Two glomps. Furnace at night. Okay. Cauldron and winter glades become thin. Now some moon kelp. And do. We have to go talk to Plum and Ladidi in the library. See if they have anything in here. Oh, what's this? Mists, liquid, combined with plants from the grove, reducing stamina, cost, and charge time. Monic, is this a permanent upgrade? Uh, ten of those things you fish up from spring, it looks like. Plum! I have two of them. That's not gonna help me. But all right, let's talk to Ladidi. When Mandy first came to me, I was cautiously optimistic to help them. Guardian Mandy, unlike the other Greenlings, comes from a people before us. Their ruins are the foundation of the mists. Where we were born from the kindergarten, Mandy was born from Winterglade's frosty forest. To us, Mandy was more than a guardian. They were a piece of a world we wanted to remember. After the other guardians were lost on their voyage, the thought of losing them jaded me to the ways of guardians. And in a way, Mandy is still lost, but even I can tell Mandy's spirit shines from the blade like pure sunlight. It's a cool blade. As long as you hold the silver sword and tread the mists, you will be our thread to guardian Mandy. Sorry, there's so much reading, I need to take a drink of water. Okay, the village elders and the other guardians have known the rot's intentions for some time now, ever since oozes congealed at the grove's roots. The grove is dying, and it has been for a very long time, hasn't it? We knew many people would not readily accept that something like the grove is in active, is in active silent decay. Yet the rot will only consume the withering. It is attempting to complete a cycle of life that is foreign to us. Thanks to its abundance of mana, the grove has lived many lifetimes. Until recently, the grove itself has played a large, vocal role in the development of life here. Fitting that we should now carry its legacy on and tend to the island ourselves. Thankfully, we still have time. The same giant creatures that plague our island prevent the rot's entry into the grove's heart. You fought them all, haven't you? Not always the aggressive beasts they are now, especially in Autumn Town. Long ago, these creatures looked very different. They were given pieces of the island's life source by Mandy's people. Seems that the hope was to propagate our mana and grow it like we grow crops. Unsuccessful, yet these benevolent and helpful giants were allowed to covet their mana. As the rot continues to gnaw at the grove, however, even these gentle giants have been corrupted. So long as the shards of dew are held away from the grove's center, the rot will not congeal there properly. You must help them. The town leaders will be opening up the grove for you, Concord. How and when you retrieve the other town's shards is up to you, but we need you to journey out and retrieve all three. You can use the silver sword to reach new places and vanquish whatever holds the rot's attention. It is a solemn task Thirdly, but we have faith in your ability. Rest up. It'd be nice to hold on to our new guardian for a day longer. I had my doubts, but objectively speaking, anyone can see you are our best path forward. Tomorrow, head westward to Bell Row, and Tarong will see you back into the Hamlet's warm climate. Already? I feel like I've only been here in like, for like three episodes, but maybe that's been the case all along. But... I really would like to get that stamina tonic. Uh, I do want to check out what... Oh, this is... Okay. 
I still need to do some chores. Pardon me. Ooh, a bow. I think I can donate that to the library. Book bag. I like that book bag. We'll go with that. Hammer improvement. Okay, the rest of that, those spots are for winter. What? Have I unlocked any yet? Let's check. I gotta donate this bow anyway. Wait, did I donate one of those? Uh, I didn't, one of these. Wow, Um, I don't know what any of this stuff is. I feel like that is... I have. Is that sap? That's probably sap. Okay, I get a sap. And I think that was that. I'm gonna grab a few things out of here just to check. Oh, bam. None of the rest of these look really familiar. Nope. Okay, let's check out. Check out, ha, library pun. Unlocked packed snow. Winter lamp. Winter seat. Blowing chamber. Let's take a look at what those are. Let me actually fish up. Looking for two of them. I forget what they're called. Hey, did my crosshairs change on this? Looks like it. It has like a new knockback ability, it looks like. I think if I remember what that said. Okay. Chunk. Oh, I can donate that. Really? A single one? Oh, right, the rock chunk, of course. <sighs> what does this say? No cap rot. That's the, uh, the mages. Um, where else can I fish? I don't know if I can find any more. Oh, maybe over here? No. Fishing spots? Well, okay. Wow, we're evening already, and I don't think I've gotten anything. 
take a look. Axe? No. Oh, it's a fence. The winter lamp? Oh, the winter lamp looks nice. Glowing chamber. That's cool, too. I knew this game was going to be much longer than it looked. When you first start playing it, it kind of has the vibe that you beat each of the four areas and you're done. But there's like lots of things around. Oh, what's this? Glass cozy. Ten glass? Oh, I could do ten glass. Um, There's like lots of things around that we haven't even touched yet. And, uh, I had an inkling in the back of my mind that this game was going to be far longer than I expected it to be. Which is nice. Stoked for it. Really, I only have seven? I didn't pick up any glass when I was trying to farm for those glass lenses. Oh. Wait a minute. You look familiar. I have two moon kelp. By familiar, I mean the, uh, it looks like a silhouette that was at the library. Okay. I still need to kill the couple of rot by the furnace. Okay, that's done. Back to the library. A couple more things to donate. Yep. Was there more glass here? There is. Three. Perfect. Got ten. Ugh. Other way. Uh, what's happening? Uh oh. Alright, I'm gonna... No, what? Oh. Like whatever you do, don't be at a 90 degree angle from it. See, this is still much faster. I think that sword is only to open up paths. Not really to fight so much. Cool. Cozy flask upgraded. Uh, hello. Why? Wow, it wouldn't let me... Wouldn't let me pull my shield out. And I looked down, I was actually hitting R. Which is correct. Alright, we're going to bed. More products in the local tavern and trader. Cool. A 
bought that new backpack, right? Yeah. Cool. I feel like a little off to wizard school. Just two chimneys and tombstones. Ugh. That one delivered. Okay. Uh, I don't know how many fat one. I'm just going to pick up three for now. Alright, I am going to head back to Spring Hamlet today. Where are those? Since these uh, quests are pretty quick. We'll take a glass lens, please. Let's head back to the hamlet. I'm a wizard now. Ah, Concord, welcome back to the hamlet. I wish circumstances were better. If we're to believe the elders, you'll be doing a lot of work in each village. I know I'm technically a guard, but... Personally, I'd never delve into those depths. I'm sure with the Silver Sword, you'll now be able to go even farther down. Mandy is surely protecting you, but... Please be careful. We're all praying for you, Concord. If you ever need to need help facing the challenges ahead, know that the villages are here to help you. You're surely acquainted with the Grove by now. Spring Hamlet, Summer Bar, Autumn Town. Head wherever your heart tells you, Guardian. There's a world out there that needs your help. So now it's open world. You can do anything you want. Ooh, wait a minute. Can I? This over here on three. A stronger tool than that? All right. Glass lenses. Ugh. And looking at the glass lens, it looks like I need one of those for the Autumn Library, too. Oh, well, this is the library. Uh, let's see. I have a couple of these. Do have one glass lens. I don't really want to use it though. So take this, 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 this. I think. Okay. If I fish up one more of those and donate a glass lens, this library will be done. So let's. I hate to- I'd hate to use the glass lens, but, I mean, this is one library I don't have to worry about. So, <laughs> let's go back to Winter Glade, actually.
Tombstone. Apparently you can never have enough of this stuff. Does this work on it? No. There's like no click when you switch weapons on your menu there. I kind of wish there was. It would give you that like, oh, okay, I know that's equipped now. If I can just fish up the rest of these spots. Boom and boom. Nothing? What? Wooden bench. Okay. Good. Spring request board. So I just unlock everything, and that's pretty much it. All right. Um. Like this hasn't even been opened yet. Before we go to bed, we're gonna, I'm gonna head south and, uh... I wanna get some more glass. Hopefully... We also wanna... Fish up more of those green things. I don't even remember what they're called. What is that? A crown? A thousand gold. I mean, that is cool. Water sprout. Okay. Only seven more of those to go. Maraschino! Oh, we got a lens! Okay, I'm just looking for really lenses at this point.
Hey. Alright, now we're just gonna head to bed. Deposit all of our glass. workshop. Home at last. We refilled our glass. So much other stuff. Oh, we have uh, seeds now. Did I refresh my seeds? I don't know if I did. We have new seeds, and I think I planted something different here. Yes! I did. Oh, okay. Two bells. I have picked these up before. certain I need to re um, refill my seed pouch too. That's something we can do in the morning. It'd be next episode though, because we're going to end it here. Got Hey, can I? No. Oh! Regular sword, though. Check that out. Have I been here before? I think I have. No, definitely not. Aha! Here we go. This is right next to my house. I've been here. I guess I didn't realize that was... ...connected up here. Okay, so this little... shortcut place. Oh, it's connected. Connected to the trade area? Yeah, look at this. Love to see this open again. I mean, it looks like it's bound to be. Granted, everything is still dark. Yes! Nope, I don't need the shards. I'll be really sad if I get to the end of the game and, like, nothing happens with that area. Uh... Yeah. It, like, wouldn't let me swing my sword for a second. Ooh, I can break stuff. Alright. Now let's go to bed. Two. Only six more to go. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you 
in the next one.